welcome to you your sugo sapsd youtube channel please subscribe channel for more videos and to get the real time support for few days today we are discussing about how to change document currency in sale order and how to capture call center in invest through sale order okay we will see now okay we will create one sale order we will create one sale order okay what is the document currency here inr right what is the document currency here inr right now i am saving so after created sale order user realized that currency was okay the currency was usd not inr now sister you can go to the change mode also slash and va02 system will not allow to change the document currency it has to be grayed out mode you can change currency ka, ka, this pricing currency we can change but document currency it will not change because of it is coming from the customer master so if you, you can see here in customer master level i will go and change the document currency sales here adapt we have the currency now i am taking the usd so i am saving now if you see here again i am going to change mode of sale order it is not changed va02 it is not changed it is still inr only okay if i create new sale order you can remember 38 okay and i am creating new sale order for new sale order system will give usd next time but what about existing open orders but existing open orders how we can change okay the t code is e w u o the t code is e w u o here enter the what is the sale order number VA03 copy that sale order number this is our sale order number right okay copy the sale order number here original currency is INR currently is INR it has to change it to USD right then click on continue this then click on execute here enter the sale order number currency new currency execute set this click on change okay in my system it is not changing but uh, it is the demo system so the version may be version is different in real time it is working i tried already so you can try in your system in real time system definitely it will work right? automatically the currency will change once you done the changes if you go and check your order va02 okay the currency will change inr to usd so for the, these changes is only for open open sale orders for okay all open sale orders man uh, manually we can change through uh, manually mean nothing but a e w u o through the t code we can change currency document currency we can change okay the second one is when you creating the sale order okay usually through sale order we can't track the cost center okay uh, you can't track because of sd point of view we have to see the profit we can't see the cost right cost when you will see that that is a purchasing point of view cost and will trigger because of what cost they are affecting but sd point of view profit we will see so in that case we can't track the uh, cost center through sale order in case if you got that kind of any requirement first we have to check with the fi team that is correct or not once fi team confirm okay if fi team asking us to track cost center through sale order okay not for all okay for particular one special case okay they are asking to track okay in that case what we have to do we have to do small config what is that first we have to define on uh, order region okay go to spro sales and distribution so this is a rare case and once confirmed from the fi team then only we have to do okay go to sales document header order region so here we will create one new order region go to new entries cost uh, jet cos cost center jet cos cost center cost cn tier cost center the cost center number i am giving here okay i am saving now this order region i am going to assign okay this order region i am going to okay I am going to send to document types. Uh, what is our document type here? Sorry. Autom automatically we can uh, say that is not a problem. 
now i am creating now i am going to configure ovf3 that t code to assign is ovf3 here go to new entries your sales organization distribution channel division okay order region whatever you created order region that order region you can assign here and the cost center whatever cost center is there you can that cost center you can assign it this is also system not allowing into me to show here okay the cost center you can assign here once you assign the cost center you can save okay you can save you just you can create the sale order once uh, just create the sale order okay just create the sale order here we are creating select the order region as jcos okay select the order as jcos you can do order delivery invoice okay a cost center i am not assigned because our system is not allowing to me in this version uh, maybe i don't have access or uh, demo system i don't have maybe access so this is not allowing you can try from your system definitely it will work we tried in our real time systems it is uh, we are already we are using okay now i am saving slash and vf03 click on accounting okay click on accounting here usually we won't track the cost center here right just you will track the profit center we can track cost center will not track so if you done that config cost center also will come here okay both profit center cost center will come here but uh, that uh, you, you thought confirmation with the above uh, i mean fi team don't do that okay once you done the uh, confirmation above uh, i mean fi team on special case okay it is it is only if you as if you assign order reason then only the cost center will trigger okay in sale order level if you assign that reason then only cost center cost center will trigger or else it won't trigger if there any that kind of special case under uh, person they want to track the cost center that time you can do this configuration definitely it will work on real time systems this one under uh, currency changes or the t code ew uo this is the currency changes t code and uh, cost center ov f3 okay this two ticket definitely it will work in real time systems you can try you can try in your systems okay okay I'll thank you thank you for your time watching the video once again please subscribe channel for more videos to get the knowledge on the different kind of topics okay next class i'm going to cover in sale order how we can assign files in sale order number we don't have option to attach the we don't have uh, option to attach the file any file right uh, so how we can attach that we can see see you don't have any option right so once we done that configuration we have we got the button to act to upload the files we'll see that in the next class once again thank you all for your time please subscribe the channel for more videos and to get the real time support for few days thank you all